in the heart of the meatpacking districts of New York, I found four beautiful guests from the Nick City Dancers. Ladies, come on in. I trust we're hungry. Yeah. Let's go. <laughs> Chef Hung Win, the boss here at Catch and also the general. We're going to try his Cantonese lobster. Over to you, Chef. All right, well, this is one of our most famous dish at uh, Catch. We're going to rip the claws off. I know that in your early days to make a living, you were in Puerto Rico. Yes, I was. You went to the CIA, to the Culinary Institute. All right, where are you finding out this information? Ah, uh, we've been <laughs> following you. We're going to take the heads apart, keep the roll to make the lobster butter, and then this part, we're going to make lobster stock for our lobster cream. Split this in half. I'm a hot ticket today. I've got a date with four women. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I can give you oysters a caviar, then. Bring it in. <laughs> and the tails, we're going to dredge it in cornstarch. Hooks very fast. All the juices are sealed in. All the shells release its flavor into the meat. We're going to blanch the claws for about five minutes and we're going to salt the water, remove the meat. We're going to cut the vegetables. I can Amazing. see the speed that you move. So we have fresh ginger, yeah. you know, a lot of garlic, and now the lobster claws that have yep. been deshelled. Lobster butter from the lobster roll, the aromatics here, yep. scallions, and this is a mixture of sake, mirin, oyster sauce, sugar, and soy. I'm going to show you a little trick. We like tricks trick. on this show. So we're going to stick a chopstick into the fryer. If it starts to bubble, you know, that's 350 degrees. Yep. That's hot. Throw it in. Be careful at home. It means one big guy or a five little person. One of me or five of you. Exactly. <laughs> well, that was rude. <laughs> Now I just smell the roasting flavor of the yeah. shell. That would go about, I'll say a minute. Look really at how bright the shells are. Perfect. So it's going to be a very, very fast dish. Right. Don't even blink. We're ready. No blinking. <laughs> First up, get the pan nice and smoking. Get a little oil. Yep. We're going to throw in ginger scallion. Smoke that, smoke that baby. You don't want to flame your pan out without the alcohol, because it's going to taste like carbon. Right. Now that's cooking. Woo, smoky. The jalapeno will get you. Be careful. Right, scallion goes in. No safety officer here. Oh, yeah. So here goes the sake. Here comes the flame, right? So fire in the hole. Going just in time for now burning. Now we throw the oyster sauce in. Lots of butter. Give it a little squish around, a little toss. Why are you so slow, Chef Hung? New York City, snooze you lose. Is that a Vietnamese saying? <laughs> So you see the lots of butter and the coral yeah. comes out now. Yeah. Nice and red. Lovely. And the starch is sticking to the sauce, right? And the sauce is sticking to the lobster. And the sweetness of the sake is still there. Gorgeous. Oh, Slight thing of alcohol. Now it's done. Voila. Beautifully yeah. done, chef. Right, let's go and entertain those ladies downstairs. All right. Are you hungry? Yes. So we have a couple of our signature dishes. A spicy tuna tartare on crispy rice cake. So tell us a little about your careers, how you keep fit, how many basketball players have proposed marriage to you. <laughs> I've been dancing my whole entire life. I also teach children dance. Ashley. I do a lot of freelance work in fashion design now, and I'm working for the company that actually made all of our gorgeous costumes. All right, Chef Hung, what else? Hamachi with a cucumber cup. Shredded daikon radish, shiso, the hamachi, add the wasabi and tofu cream, and some toasted pine nuts, scallions, and a touch of Aleppo pepper. We have a corn and edamame succotash. Peppers, onions, zucchini, roasted tomatoes and edamame, roasted corn, kabayaki sauce, a little bit of water, and a touch of chives and cilantro. The texture is nice and sticky. This is his signature, Cantonese lobster. He's world famous for this. Mmm, really good. Lobster mac and cheese. Oh, I think you ladies would love this one. And what's different about this lobster mac and cheese? Well, it's made with a lot of lobsters that's been reduced. It's very light, it has tons of flavor in there. Enjoy. Thank you, Thank Chef you. Hung. Thank you. It looks amazing. I'm excited to try it. Mm. Mm. Well, I'm a fan of macaroni and cheese, mm -hmm. so this lobster mac and cheese is delicious. Excellent. It's unique. You can still taste the seafood, but it's not too much. So I really, really... Are you after my job? <laughs> <laughs> You're too good at this. Anna, what about you? I like the lobster. I think it's delicious. Latoya? I like the tuna. I like spicy food, so I'm always attracted to that. And Ashley? Same, I love the tuna, but the mac and cheese lobsters, a close second. Send me up the macaroni cheese, I'd like some more. You all <laughs> look in magnificent shape. How many hours a day are you having to exercise? Well, we try to get one workout in a day. You also watch what we eat. I eat like this three times a day. 
This is my workout. It's wonderful. Latoya, what qualifications do we need to become a Nick City dancer? You have to have some technical training, whether it's ballet, jazz, contemporary, modern. And how many girls are in the troupe? There's 20 of us. Any chance after dinner that I could see one of the routine? <laughs> <laughs> we can do that. So thanks for being my guest. Thank you for Thank having, you for having us. us. Can you keep this going for a few hours? <laughs>